It is quickly becoming my favorite routine and it should become your routine as well, no matter what your industry is. Yes, I'm talking about the Gemba Walk. I can hear you asking, what is a Gemba Walk, Gordon? Gemba Walk is an increasingly popular management technique. Gemba literally means the place in Japanese. So a Gemba Walk effectively means go to the place where the action is. By visiting the place where work is done, leaders gain valuable insight into the flow of value through the organization and uncover opportunities to improve efficiency and learn new ways to support employees. The British even unwittingly made a TV series about Gemba called Back to the Floor. Even though this was a reality TV series, it was in essence a secret or not so secret Gemba walk. Great results depend on thoughtful planning, execution and follow up. Here are the most important steps you can take to ensure that your next Gemba walk is successful. Prepare your team. Let your team members know what a Gemba walk is and why they will be observed during this process. Have a plan. Prepare questions to ask and have a structured plan laid out. Follow the value stream. Follow the flow of value and observe areas with a high potential for waste that can be optimized. Focus on processes, not people. These walks are not employee performance evaluations. They are meant for observation, understanding and improvement. Document your observations. Always log your observations and record your findings. Ask questions. Ask who, what, where, when and why questions to uncover why operations are performed in a particular way. I always tell my guys to ask the obvious and even sometimes the dumb questions that you think you already know the answer to because sometimes you get a really unexpected answer that could be the key to unlocking greater efficiency. Walk in teams. These walks are quite effective in teams, especially if the walk involves people from other departments. A fresh pair of somewhat untrained eyes can sometimes see things that experienced eyes cannot. Mix up the schedule. Gemba walks should not be scheduled at the same time every week. Mix it up to see how the processes change throughout the day or the week. The follow-up. Follow up with employees to share what you've learned and plan ahead for your next steps. Return to the Gemba. Perform future Gemba walks to observe the changes you've implemented and if they achieve the desired results. If you want to know more about this, look up PDCA cycle. PDCA stands for Plan, Do, Check, Act, but I personally prefer Plan, Do, Check and Adjust. Using the Gemba walk and PDCA, my own company has increased factory throughput from the same number of machines and people by more than 80% in the last two years. And I will reiterate, that asking the dumb obvious questions is sometimes the best way to find the best ideas. Follow this and I guarantee you some positive and impactful changes in your workplace. So thanks for watching and listening and I'll see you guys again soon with another Factory Insights video. Factory Insights with Gordon Stiles.